it's the crypto lightsaber back with another video uh, let's just talk about alien worlds today and do an update on that uh, some of you might have seen my previous video where i said that i expected some more upside from alien worlds that was about this level here in the previous video we were sitting at about 30 cents at the time of recording the previous video and since then it did have a pullback all right guys but it pulled back perfectly to this trend line over here and got a bounce at around 14 cents all right guys it's up approximately 100 percent in fact it might be a little bit more at the time of recording this now uh, reached the top of about 154 percent from that pullback range all right guys so that is a very nice move to the upside you can see that the volume is coming in all right guys and the 24 hour trading volume says about 2 billion here on binance if we go to coin gecko it's approximately 800 million in trading volume uh, for the 24 hours uh, metrics all right guys so that that is very bullish at, at the end of the day over the next couple of days and maybe in the next week we could see a lot more upside for alien worlds and of course you can see i have a target here around 41 uh, or just over 41 about 42 cents um, which would basically line up with this horizontal range for the next level of resistance okay guys um, also i have a higher range in the longer term for uh, profit potential okay guys and obviously it looks here like i've just marked out the previous high level but there is a little bit more technicality to how i came with that prediction for about 84 cents it's not a price prediction it's just a price range that i'm looking at for potential profit taking and that's basically just by drawing a fibonacci retracement uh, um, level on here going from the previous bottom okay and um, just basically bringing my 0.618 level up to the top of this move right here as you can see there we go from the bottom there and we bring the, six, the 0.618 level up to the top of the previous high or the current high um, on the alien worlds and that's how we get a target all the way up here uh, to about uh, 82 83 84 cents within that range okay guys so that's how i come with that target there but that obviously is in the much longer term and longer by longer term i say i should say mid-term actually because i'm hoping for some follow-through on this we've seen nft coins really take off like axie infinity and um, coins like that so um alien worlds is another nft token that has great potential in my opinion and of course the 24 hour volume would suggest that a lot of other people are kind of seeing that and trading based on that as well. So, um, yeah, there could be some uh, major upside for this token. Of course, we are on the one day chart. So let's just quickly lower the time frame to the four hour and show you one more pattern that I'm looking at, which is why I'm super bullish on this token. OK, so right now it does look like it is setting up a large cup and handle, which has actually broken at the time of recording okay so we have a cup right here and a big handle okay guys so obviously that's how i um i trade a lot of the time is pattern trading all right guys so that cup and handle definitely looks bullish way in since last night for it to actually break this level okay guys and now i'm confident it has broken potentially okay guys and uh obviously the volume looks really good as well the volume breakout of this uh cup and handle pattern if we put a resistance somewhere over here and we see we get that volume breakout which looks really good and it looks like it's trying to retest that level okay uh, the major move, moving averages are holding this level as well so um yeah i think we will get continuation to the upside for alien worlds and of course like i said before my first target would be around 42 cents which is approximately 34 35 percent from here and if it does break that level, I would expect it to break out and kind of touch this level at around 50 cents and then pull back to retest the 42 cents level before potentially getting some more upside. But um, the pullbacks can be, um, you know, much larger than anticipated. Sometimes um, Alien Worlds had a very large pullback after the previous move. OK, guys, I didn't expect the pullback to be as big. All right, guys, but I did manage to get some nice lines on here. I kind of anticipated that we would get a breakout of this kind of descending resistance or falling wedge 
we got a nice volume spike out of there. And you see when we get these volume spikes, the follow through doesn't always come through immediately. It actually rolled over and pulled back to the previous line of support before the volume came back in and we got that major move to the upside, all right, which is still happening now. So we're looking for that continuation. Uh, this volume looks really good. It's kind of curling round as well. That rounding bottom formation looks really nice. And that is the handle from the cup and handle. Um, it won't be unusual to see it pull back as well and the volume kind of dip and we get that W pattern before the next move to the upside. But I would anticipate based on the trading volume that it will probably just push through uh, this resistance potentially and uh, we can get that upside potential. Okay, but of course, like I said, I'm watching that level around 42 cents for potential profit taking. Okay, guys, the RSI um, looks like it still could run a little bit more. It's currently... Yeah, you could say it's overbought at the moment at around 70. But if we look at the previous high on the RSI, that's around 90, 92. So there could still be more room for the RSI to run on the four hour. Uh, on the MACD, um, you know, it has crossed bullish uh, from all the way down here and the momentum is pretty high. So that could be a little bit of a rollover. But sometimes um, you can be deceived by the indicators. Okay, guys. If we go on one day, still more room for the RSI to go up. Of course, we have that large cup and handle as well on the RSI. And it looks like the MACD could have a lot more upside in it uh, on, on the one day. Okay, guys, if I um, just like make sure you can see that. Okay, you can see that the blue line is uh, coming up over the histogram and you have the momentum coming to the upside so that's really bullish okay guys there could be a lot more room in that because you know we've got all of this area here that hasn't been affected by it yet all right guys that would be nice to see the momentum continue to the upside on the mat d for alien worlds okay guys so yeah if you're not subscribed to the channel do me a favor and subscribe if you like the video that helps with the algorithm comment down below and uh i'll see you guys in the next video